Okay, let's go. Let's go. Where are we going? Uh, yeah, I've got a couple of things for you. There's a story that's happening at uh, what we call in the Freistaat the coffee shop. The coffee shop? No, the cop shop. The police station. In the Freistaat? We call it the cop shop. Where all the cops are. Oh, cop shop. Yes. Well, well the it's police like the cop. the cop shop. The, the cop shop. <laughs> oh, oh, it's my psychiatrist. I, I used to go visit the cop shop quite often. <laughs> and I'm, I'm much better that, now. That's a different cop shop. Yeah, I was my cop I was is much better little, now. But, uh, yeah. I know it, what's happening there. I saw them pull out the floor and put the concrete ah, down. Is that what so you want to tell me? know about it, I yes. I know everything. So, uh, well, I think Catherine Marshall might be there. So let's go have a look if she's there, because oh, she's stop doing that whole, whole thing. We can go stop at the cop shop, I can do with a bit of uh, cop doctoring. Cop doctoring. So, um, Casper, how did you go open our oh, house quickly? So, um, we drove past and I said to look, there's people painting. Yes, yeah, yeah so, so it is open. What are they doing? What is this? Okay, so, I'm starting. <laughs> I've started already. Okay. <laughs> So one of the projects that was brought to our attention is the um, Victim um, Empowerment Centre that they run um, for the staff people. And they were, uh, the floor was breaking, there's windows that are broken and the lights. So as a team we have just come together and we've cast a slab which we put a proper flooring in and then we're doing a full revamp of the of the center which okay. directly links to SAPS supporting all people that need um, support due to anything. How did you, how did you come to know of the, the state of this and that it needed a thing? So in the CTF meeting um, which is a community, community policing forum um, it was with Sarah who runs it, this lady um, from the community runs it and she um, put the, on the table for us to um, pick up and sort out yeah. so we volunteered to to get this something that's just very very close to my heart yeah. um, and I've been done it before and um, yeah just creating a safe space that if anybody that's how it came came about was and, and, and a safe uh, a safe space place needs to be inviting and, and, and exactly. not uh, be dilapidated because exactly. <laughs> you you want to make that person feel quite at home and crazy exactly, and, and yes. so, so we're so going to so put a whole new system in, in place there so you'll see it's, it's separated this has been done by other organizations in Stanford so we're literally just taking the foundation of what has been done and kindly donated by many organizations in Stanford but what we're doing is that we're just doing a little bit of a revamp yeah. um, but just because it's time so yeah. the flooring was coming and done um, and yeah, we've got um, donations. We're wanting to plant a garden this side. Uh, we are also getting a mural put in, in there. Guys, I've lost Etienne. I don't know where he is. The last time I saw him, we got out at the police station. I don't know if it's got something to do with the missing palm trees, but I'm still looking for him. Wait, I see him. He's at the back of the police station. Let's go pick him up. Hey, where you been? Uh, we're clear, eh? You're clear? We're clear, yeah. I lost so you there for a bit. Huh? My cameraman, you can take your camera. Thank you very no, much. I thought I lost it in there for a bit. Yeah, you did lose me. Oh, but oh. it's not for long. <laughs> He's back. Today. He's back. Are you recording? Yes. Oh. <laughs> so yeah. you, you the one that's scaling. I'm the one that's jailing for a minute. Ah. Because I actually ran off to check in one of my oh, guests. No. Yeah. Oh, no. oh, good. So, oh. nice that's why I smell like a, like a fire. So, the police. Light yeah. the so, she, she just told me the police station's opening a nursery at the back here. Um, to, For big to babies. We like plant all the confiscated. Oh, it's a long story. <laughs> but I'll tell you on the way. So, you had a blind date on me after our first pickup. <laughs> you just left me. Bad wingman. No, yeah, you you just left me. Yes. Ah, it's called a day job. This other thing uh, happening in S September that I I might I know. Um, mm. and and it's I struggle with some words, and the one word I struggle with is huh? Kalanenareri. Kalanenareri. Yeah, I struggle with the word Kalanenareri. Oh, you're talking about the culinary yeah. festival. Kalanenareri. Just call it food, man. I don't know. Yeah, food festival. This, yeah. I don't know why I struggle with that word. Culinary. It's culinary. A roll of your tongue. Culinary. Culinary. Yes, close. 
Okay, so there's a culinary festival in September in, in um, Stanford, yes. as far as I know. That's right. And, and uh, oh, look who's here. This is Rishi, who is part of Stanford Tourism. That's and amazing. she's a big part of the culinary festival. Oh, Rishi? Yes. So, in, come here. Come, Rishi. Come. Not too bad. <laughs> first, first pick, pick up. up. First pick up. How are you? Oh, good. How good, are you guys? Good. Hello. Hello. Good Hello. Long time to see you. Yeah, it's been. It's yeah. been a while, yeah. We were talking about the, the word that I struggle to say. I struggle to say a few words, and the one I do struggle with is culinary. Culinary. Uh, <laughs> culinary. Culinary. Yes. Culinary. Because it's, um, it's, it's just difficult for me. So we were talking about the culinary festival. Yeah. And so Casper said, you know everything about the culinary festival. Uh, yeah. Sort of everything. Yeah. Okay, well, you know enough. Much, I, I know a lot. So, so yeah. we picked you up in front of Madre. Is that is that is, is Madre's uh, part of the culinary festival? Yes, hopefully. Yes. Uh, okay. uh, we are busy finalizing things with a lot of the participants. Yeah. Uh, but yes, we have spoken to Madre and we're very obviously very keen for her to be a part of it. Uh, mm. Of it so so what do, what is what are they good at what's hap what's happening what is what is the deal <laughs> so um it's it's a weekend long event a four day weekend long event yeah. um and it's gonna be a, a celebration of food um heritage and culture so food heritage and yeah and culture. culture so basically it comes out of um comes out of the fact that the Overstrand actually has a UNESCO status. Did you guys know that? No, I didn't. No? Yeah, I did. Yeah, it's fine. Right. You, <laughs> you, you're supposed to. Yeah. Know. yeah. <laughs> Smart ass. Uh, <laughs> oh, this anyway. one. So yeah, a lot of people don't know that, which is you know, it's actually quite a big honor, you know. Um, so the Overstrand was given the award of um, a. Um, UNESCO Creative uh, Region of Gastronomy. Um, so UNESCO, they go out and they sort of. There's another big word. <laughs> <laughs> she said gastronomy. Gastronomy, creative city of food, basically. Okay. You know, yeah. um, Why and, didn't I say that? Yeah. So you know that's um, UNESCO chooses these areas as they're not the places with the fancy restaurants and all of that. They're they're the places where the story of the area is told through its food, basically. Um, That's interesting. Yeah, mm. uh, suddenly it makes a lot more sense. Yeah. So, so yeah, so this was given to us uh, some years ago. Um, and it's sort of, uh, you know, it, 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 it signifies the fact that um, it's an area where culture is really expressed through food, you know? So there's, you know, there's all of the local food, there's all of the, you know, there's yeah, exactly. Yep. You know, okay. there's all of the farmers. That there's all of the food producers. Yeah. Um, so it's really an area where you know people express themselves through the food that they make. So one highlight of mine, one of my favorite parts of it, is the dine with the local. Um, so all over, all over Stanford, people will be opening their homes mm. to uh, to invite people in. So we'll have taxis running into the Skirma, into Tempelishle, the Kop. Um, to actually uh, give people the opportunity to come and experience meals, so in like almost home cooked, home Absolutely. cooked meals. It would um, exactly be that. And and with that comes comes heritage because yes. uh, from all walks of life, uh, my mother's been making things a certain way that I got from her. And that's exactly the point, you know. Awesome, so yeah. it's it's really uh, yeah, and we'll have some storytelling in there. It's probably quite diverse also in our time because I think there's yeah. there's a uh, there's a whole, there's a very diverse group of people here. Exactly. Correct. And Correct. that's what we're really wanting to capture, you know, because... Lots of heritage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. And a lot of diversity and, and to really represent all of these beautiful cultures that come in and mix in the village and create this unique Stanfordness. Did, yeah. we, did we mention a date? Uh, yes, so it will be on the 29th of September and running for four days. Okay, great. Yeah. That's nice. A cup of tea is nice. That's nice. The lady at the preschool is nice. nice. And it'll, it'll be based on ticket sales? Ticket sales. So yes. you'll be able so to visit buy the website online, down here. Stanfordculinary.co.za 
Um, if you're wanting to be a participant and you haven't heard from us, uh, this is not anything personal. We're just really busy and really trying to get to everybody. So if you do make food or if you are in any way a foodie or would like to offer a workshop or anything like that, uh, just get in touch with us. Is Go there like a website. limit of, of, of the amount of people that, that will be included in this? We will have to put a cap on it at some point. Yeah. Uh, we're not, you know, this is our sort of inaugural event, so we're all mm. learning as we're going. Yeah. Um, I don't have a specific number, but uh, you know, we, we can't just sort of take. Uh, sure. More but it's something yeah. to look forward to. to yes. Yeah. And it's, it's, and it's going to be an annual event from there on. Absolutely. It's really the, yes. the whole point is that we want to create something, you know, with longevity. You know. The ticket um, sales. Yes, you'll be, you'll be able to buy them via our website um, for each of the individual From when? things as soon as possible. As soon as we can okay. get our ducks in a row. Because I want to tell people from outside the village yeah. to come here Absolutely. and book at Casper's lovely places and, yeah, yeah, and exactly. enjoy the weekend. That's exactly. so. You should really, and, and there'll be something for everybody. There'll be something for the kids, some workshops, some fine dining experiences. So you can really plan your whole weekend around it. You know, okay. um, yeah. and that's what we hope that people will do. Fantastic. Um, and this year also, so we're gonna have a we have a theme, and that's bees. So we're gonna try and put a little bit of focus on all of the ways that bees are really honey, fundamental bees, to our lives. Yeah. yeah. So all of the participants of has to use honey. They or, will, or have a bee they theme. They will theme yeah. around it. Yeah, they will ah. sort of, uh, you know, weave around with their creative juices around the theme of bees or honey or yes. flowers, pollination. Black and yellow, black and yellow, yellow and black. Yeah, or whatever. Yeah, you know? oh, obviously <laughs> flowers. Yeah. Because yeah. the bees. Because well, it's the farming side of it too, you know. So yeah, yeah, that is uh, correct. Yeah. Pollination well, that's awesome. So awesome, Rishi. Um, yeah. yeah, thank you for giving us some insight. Yeah. And then closer to the time, we might run into you again. Absolutely. But we're going to yeah. kick you out the car now. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> You're not a good driver anyway. So. Yeah, you feel that, eh? Casper yeah. yeah. has got yeah. a way to find the potholes. Yeah. yeah. Good yeah. drive yeah. like you're still on the game farm, eh? Yes. <laughs> you know, I miss those eight, That was eh? lovely, Rishi. That yeah. was too yeah. lovely. Thank you so car. much, guys. Yeah, thank you so much. Please carry on driving safe. Okay, bye. Bye, Rishi. Nice bye. Okay. That was a mouthful. Jeez. And an, ear, and an earful. Yeah, but. Um, not bad for a first pickup, eh? Not bad at all. <laughs> okay. A culinary festival with. Deep. Deconstructed, Deconstructed festival. festival with what's the other word? The UNESCO rocket grow. I literally, I, I, I forgot it. Yeah, it's, 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 it's out. Just rewind and go watch it again. No, not you. Oh, crazy. Uh,